Ketamine is a dissociative anesthetic routinely used for the induction of rapid sequence intubation and works by blocking NMDA receptors. The induction dose of ketamine is 1 to 2 mg per kilogram intravenously. So, for example, in a 70 kilo male, your induction dose of ketamine would be approximately 70 to 140 mg. Ketamine can also be used for post intubation sedation at a starting dose of 0.01 to 0.03 mg per kilogram per minute. The time of onset is 45 to 60 seconds, and the duration is typically 10 to 20 minutes. Previously, it was thought that ketamine led to an increase in intracranial pressure, and thus was not recommended for rapid sequence intubation in patients with traumatic brain injuries. Recent literature, however, suggests that ketamine does not increase intracranial pressure, and in some cases may even lower it. Regardless, this topic of ketamine and intracranial pressure still remains controversial. The main contraindication to ketamine is hypersensitivity to the drug. Adverse effects include emergence reactions, increased intraocular pressures, hypertension, and tachycardia. Given the hypertension and tachycardia, ketamine should be used in caution in patients with cardiovascular diseases. Another adverse effect of ketamine, although rare, is laryngospasm. Ketamine has been associated with hypersecretion of the salivary glands, which may theoretically make intubation more difficult. Ketamine is a favorable drug amongst emergency providers, especially in the setting of hypotension, because it is not as likely to cause further decreases in blood pressure. Ketamine has also been shown to have bronchodilatory effects, making it useful for intubation in patients with COPD and asthma.